Hello everybody, my name is Thomas Cottrell and today I'm going to be going over to you what is the best football boot to buy in today's market. You should definitely check it out. Hello everybody, my name is Thomas Cottrell and I'm going to be your host today and today I'm going to be marketing and campaigning the very important F50 football boot from Adidas. Now, what do you want in a football cleat these days? Well, you want three criteria. You want lightness, you want durability, and you want comfort, and also the most important thing, you also want a fair price because football boots are becoming extremely expensive in our society. So you have to pick the ones that fit all that criteria and are also not going to have you spend a lot of money. Now, the foot F50 range from Adidas is the range in which I would recommend all users buy, okay? It's absolutely fantastic, okay? And I'm gonna be going over the individual generations and how they affected football and football boots for the future. Now, in my hand, I have the first generation of F50 football boots. I apologize for the green. It's not necessarily the best color, I understand, but eh, I got these a while ago. And these are absolutely fantastic football boots. I've loved them. They're absolutely fantastic. The reason why I love them is because, one, they're so light. I mean, they they're, they're really are the lightest cleat I've ever had the privilege of playing with. And look at that. Look at, the, look at the flexibility. I mean, like, that is just fantastic leather being made into it. And also, it's just so light. It's, it's absolutely fantastic. And as you can see, the studs at the bottom are prototypical F50 studs, in which case they promote agility and speed, okay? And these are were extremely successful, and Adidas knew that this was a real moneymaker. So they in depth, so they created, sorry, they created the second generation of the F50 boot, to which I have right here. Hello everybody, welcome back. As I promised just before the break, I do have the second generation of the Adidas F50 football range. And here they are right here in front of you. These are absolutely fantastic football boots. I absolutely recommend it. And the best part about these is that since they were made a couple years ago, they are actually quite cheaper than their successors, which are much more expensive. Now, okay, as we realized from the first generation, there were a few improvements that needed to be made. But what the first generation did is that it marked as a fantastic starting point and just showed the potential of the Adidas F50 range. The Adidas F50 range is all about speed and lightness, and this boot delivers. It is just absolutely fantastic. It is actually surprisingly much lighter than its predecessor, the green ones that I just showed you. And also, if you look at this, look at that texture. They, they changed... They changed some of the front layer of the boot in some areas to the point where you might need to pass the ball in the middle. And this is just absolutely fantastic because it allows the boot to be not as slick as its predecessor. And they really did a fantastic job of that. In other news, the boot is very much, you know, why fix something that isn't broke? It, the, the predecessor was just a fantastic boot. And all they did here is they made a few minor tweaks to make it that much better. One of the big things in my mind is the durability, okay? As you can see, these are not perfectly clean, I understand that. And that just makes my point much more forward and eloquently, is that despite, I've been playing this for two years by the way, and despite these years of hardship and hard tackling, these boots have just absolutely stayed in perfect condition. You know, maybe a little bit dirty here and there, but hey, no scratches, no loose sewing, no nothing. I mean, these were durably made. And, th and this is why this boot is just absolutely fantastic, because most lightweight football boots, much like Adidas, Superfly, and all those, you know, they're fantastic football boots, but they don't usually last too long. And these, on the market now, are roughly around $95, and these are one of the best football boots I would definitely recommend getting, because they're cheap. They're extremely comfortable, okay? As you can see here, look at that, you see the insoles there? Those holes prevent blisters, and it's just fantastic. I mean, this boot covers every ground, and it's just so amazingly fun to play in. All right, now that I went over the second generation, I also have a pair of indoor F50 boots that I hope you will all enjoy. Hello everybody, I hope you enjoyed all those demonstrations to which I provided for you. I'm sorry I have to leave you, but this video is only supposed to be 3 to 4 minutes and I'm already stretching it. But just to clarify what I, what I already said, you know, summer is approaching and soccer season is almost a us. So if you're looking for a football boot, go with the F50 range. They're fantastic, they're comfortable, they're lightweight, they're durable, and they're pretty cheap if you know exactly where you're looking for. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed this little campaign that I've devised. I hope you guys enjoy your football boots, 
And yeah, absolutely. If you're looking for a cheap foot holder, get the F50 branch, okay? I promise you, you will not regret it. See you later, guys.